What's up, beautiful people? I'm Lucy, and you're watching the Edit With Me Monday show. The show where we make editing in Lightroom super, super simple. And speaking of simple, today I'm talking about simple skin retouching in Lightroom so you can easily get rid of little blemishes, little flaws in your portraits to make them look on point. And I will quickly mention though that if you're doing more advanced portraits or professional work, you should be doing your skin retouching over in Photoshop. I might do a tutorial on that in the future. But if you're just getting started, maybe you're new to portraits, you're new to Lightroom, then Lightroom is a great place to start learning skin retouching. So I'm gonna quickly take a little self-portrait here so we can retouch that. I felt kind of weird like taking a photo of a friend or a model and like retouching their skin like on camera. I was like, I don't know if I wanna do that, so I'm just gonna retouch myself. So let's take the photo and jump in to Lightroom. So I'm here in Lightroom, I've picked my photo, I've done a few just basic edits, and now I'm ready to do the skin retouching. So to get started, just go to the first area that you wanna to touch up. I'm gonna to do this hand, and click on the spot removal button right here. Now, the thing that's great about this is what it's gonna do is we're gonna highlight that area that we wanna change, click it, and it's gonna pick a better patch of skin. Now, if you're looking at this, you can see there's like this big, big swatch. So we're gonna make that a bit smaller and we're not gonna feather it so, so much. We'll make that feathering a bit smaller. So click on my hand. This is the interesting part and sometimes people don't know this. When you click on it, the spot removal tool is gonna do its best job to grab a similar piece from your photo to replace that element. Sometimes the AI doesn't always get it quite right. So it's going to my bracelet, that would look super weird. So what I'm gonna do is just go to the patch that it's selecting and move it to a better spot. So I'm gonna move it more in and around near my hand until I find a good spot. Now that's pretty good. The other thing that you're gonna to wanna to do is you can adjust the opacity. So I can have this very, very high and see nothing or still let a bit of the skin that is naturally there show through. So I'm gonna do that there. So go ahead, zoom out, and that's looking, that's looking pretty good. I kinda just erased that mark there. So now I'm gonna go do a few more. I'm gonna get these little, uh, this, this breakout happening here. I really don't wanna be showing this on the internet, but uh, that's what we're doing. So again, we're gonna go grab that spot removal make it that right size that you want it to be. I like to keep it as small as possible. I'm gonna move the opacity up a bit because I really don't want any of this red stuff showing through. And look, on its own, it picked a great spot. Do that one. On its own, picked a good spot. All right, so we have a few more little spots to clean up. You can be as detailed with this as you like. Again, try to keep that spot tool as small as possible. And again, that's picking from a spot that's not the greatest, so just move it to a better one. There, gonna get rid of some of those little dark areas in there. And then kind of try to fix that up. So I'll just get a few more of those spots. This looks really good, so you could stop here. I'm gonna show you one more little thing. We're gonna just grab this brush tool here. And what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna do the clarity. Now, we're gonna take the clarity down and what this essentially does is skin smoothing. Don't do it too much again or you're gonna get that airbrush look. So we're just gonna bring it down a bit, bring up the sharpness to kind of compensate for the fact that we're smoothing that out. And with this one, we are just gonna go over the entire face. So you can kind of see how that's affecting that there. It's really giving my skin like, ooh, it's looking good. And then you can click this little button to show your mask to make sure you covered everything. And wow, did not cover it all. So that's pretty good. Again, I don't need this to be perfect. I'm just trying to fix things up a little bit. Unclick, and I like that. So see, if I move this all the way here, that's, that's getting to the realm of looking really, really fake. So we're just gonna go more around here, still let those natural kind of elements of your skin shine through, but just tidied it up a bit, all right? Zoom on out, and that looks really good. So before, after. 
before, after. Really, we just took out those like temporary imperfections, um, little, little scratches, blemishes, things like that, and just did a really nice basic skin smoothing. So that's the before and the after. So I'm really, really happy with that edit. All right, so that's how you do simple skin retouching in Lightroom. So go out this week and take some photos and practice these tips on your portraits and see the difference that it makes and, and actually how easy it is to do. All right, guys, I will see you next week. Peace out.